What's up, everybody? We are now in the Cream City, and the first thing we're gonna see is Charon, who is going to uh, take us to the Pokemon Center of Necreen City. And right as we get there, he's going to uh, turn around and give us some Chesto Berries. And they awaken a sleeping Pokemon. So, now that he is uh, out of the picture, we can do whatever the hell we want. So, the first thing I'm going to do is heal my Pokemon real quick. And now we are going to go off to the west to these uh, two houses. The first house here, upstairs isn't really anything worthwhile. And then right here, we find a person who sells some stuff. And it's just a bunch of X items, guard spec, and dire hit. Which I always think are great for um, gym leader battles. Because you can just throw out like an X attack or an X defend or something like that. And it'll, you know, even if your Pokemon are, like, slightly lower level than the Gym Leader Pokemon, it'll pretty much put you at, like, a level playing field. And then in this house, you can see there's three choices, Snivy, Oshawott, and Tepig. You want to pick one according to the uh, type, and she'll give you an item of that type to power up those moves by 20%. That sounded like... Complete stupidity on my part, but essentially, she'll give you an item that will boost either grass, fire, or water moves by 20%. And I wouldn't suggest choosing Snivy, considering in the Pinwheel Forest, you'll find that item, which is the uh, Miracle Seed, I think. So, I think I chose the item to boost up my Elements of Monkeys powers. But... Now we're in this uh, this new house, and that chick on the second floor will trade for the opposite Pokemon of your version, either Cottony or Petalil. In black, you can trade a Cottony for her Petalil, and in white, you can trade your Petalil for her Cottony. <clears throat> and uh, the good thing about that is it's the first in-game trade, which will... Uh, any Pokemon that you've traded for, that you train up, will gain, I think it's like 1.5 times the amount of experience. So it'll grow a hell of a lot faster. And on top of that, once you get the experience share in Castellia City, if you throw that on top of it, it'll, you know, it'll grow faster than anything you can train yourself. And in that uh, little cafe or whatever it is, I think it's on Wednesdays, the uh, the waitress will give you a lemonade, but that's not really that big of a deal. Here we are battling N for the second time, and the recurring theme with N's Pokemon is uh, that he uses Pokemon that you can find in the area surrounding where your battle is. Like for example, he's fighting now with... Uh, Pokemon that you can find in Outer Pinwheel Forest, which is off to the west, which the next video is going to be of. So here he has a Pidove, which isn't a big deal. I'm using my Blitzel in hopes that my uh, type advantage will work out for me. But he just used Quick Attack and took out like half of my HP. So, and even me using a super effective attack pretty much did the same amount of damage relatively. So that plan didn't really work out. But again, like Blitzel, I don't know if it was just the Blitzel that I caught, but I really don't think it's that great of a Pokemon, to be honest. Now I'm using my Panpour. I got two levels up on him. So that should probably take him out. Yep. And I think his next Pokemon that he sends out is Timpole, which is the first time we've seen that Pokemon. And it kind of brings up the point of, like, introducing useless Pokemon again, because in reality, it's more or less like Poliwag, you know? Like, why the hell did they pretty much make the same Pokemon again? But, anyway, my Servine should be able to knock it out in one hit, I would assume. Yep, there we go. And its last Pokemon is Timber, who 
we haven't seen yet either. And um, Timber is a Pokemon that you can also catch in uh, Outer Pinia Forest. And considering the Necreen City Gym leader uses normal Pokemon, I would suggest catching a Timber because you can really, like, bulldoze through uh, the Necreen City Gym if you get a Timber. Timber. And that's actually something that they've done with Pokemon Black, where they pretty much have a Pokemon available to catch right by the gym that is super effective against the gym leader. Like, for example, Castellia City's gym is a bug Pokemon gym. And to the north in Route 4, you can go catch a uh, Darumaka. And, uh, although maybe that's the second stage, but anyway, you, yeah, you can catch a fire Pokemon that will rip through pretty much all of that gym. And, yeah, that, that's more or less how it goes throughout this entire game. But, anyway, we are now at the end of the video, and the next video is going to be Outer Pinwheel Forest, where we're going to catch a Timber to help us out with the Necreen City Gym. So, I'll see you there.